Okay, yeah, guys, so here we go. So, this is Chinese Temple Tour. There's the traffic y Tobago Avenue. Morning. Got an elephant for you. And it sounds like they're having a ceremony of some kind inside the temple, but there it is. Here's the lovely gardens. The fat Buddha. And. It's going to be a bit noisy when we go past the uh, temple here. So the Chinese community will be having a little small thing with about five, six people inside, I think. Ah, not even that. Oh, yeah, they're downstairs. That's okay. So actually they're not in the temple. But there's a temple with the Buddha up there. Bell. Drum. We're just going to go into the main part of the temple now. Here we go, up the steps. Right. So here's the Chinese tea room, which is the main office. That's where a lot of the, that's where the Shifu hangs out. And here's another part of another shrine with a Guanyin goddess there. So there's the rooms that goes up to my area, the monks dwelling quarters. Down there is the library and where they're doing the ceremony. It's an eating area. Here's the main eating area where we eat. This is my seat. This is where I seat and this is a very nice thing. The rotating thing in the middle. I'm just going to say hi to Annalyn, the cook. Hi Annalyn. Just say hello to my cousin. Hi, hello. <laughs> She's one who does amazing things with cooking every day here. <laughs> all right. My cousin? Yeah, 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 my cousin. And here's all the preparations going on for the food. And the soups and things. There you go, that's the kitchen. And I'm just gonna go on the upstairs and there's a couple of other areas around. Uh, sort of neighbors, schools over there. Upstairs. Here we go. Let's go up the stairs. Blah, 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 blah. Huge place. So here we go. This is the out of limits area. Just for moves. There's a nice corridor. Goes up there. You go up to the tower. And this way to my room. I've got actually the master room, biggest one in the place. Very grand. Might be a bit dark. I think we have to turn the lights on, which case you see all the fluff and dust. Um. Yeah. So this is actually my room, and now at the minute it's a little bit of a state because I'm trying to do things with soundproofing, and it looks like a complete bird's nest. So yeah, normally there's all windows along there, but I'm trying to put soundproofing experiments in, including these at the top. There's a water bottles to fill those alcoves, mattresses in all the windows, pillows in all the windows. And I'm thinking what to do with these cardboard panels, like whether to put a sort of poster up or maybe just a um, cover it in simulated wood or even actual wood. But these are all lovely uh, wood panels of my RM. So let's get back a bit of the Wi Fi. This is my reclining thing, which is lovely because you can, it rocks. It's made out of natural bamboo. Very, very comfortable. There's my sleeping space, which also has those orthopedic uh, mattress underneath and a fan, a little aircon. Uh, so I nothing to say about that. Don't really get mosquitoes up here because there's hundreds of bats out there uh, just outside the windows. But this is my main working area where I make those videos and stuff with a microphone and uh, my old iPad, which is a bit Brockman, a Buddha, the clock, my MacBook, JBL Air drop speaker, and an iPad and iPhone. And that's kind of, that's a battery thing. It's a big chunky battery. 
Um, the all dispensable, indispensable coffee, which I've been recently getting from Starbucks by the ton as beans, and I recently got a uh, grinder. And um, oh, actually, this is my new experience, one of my new experiments, which is having a little meditation cupboard with a another aircon thing here, and just sit in here, and it's very soundproofed and very. You know, for a 10, 15 minutes sitting there, just yeah, away from all of the distractions. Can't hear any noise outside. Um, schedules for work, for school. And then I've got a desk over here, but I don't really use it these days. It's just sort of storing books and things. These are the new soundproof panel things. I haven't decided where to put them yet. Um, yeah, different experiments for soundproofing. These are bottle, water bottles. And this is a uh, foam. So I've got more of that kind of stuff around that I'm trying out. Um, that's it really, it's very comfy. I usually keep it very dark and with soft lighting. And norm normally at the minute these days, I'll put a, this on, I think it's on it now. Yeah, I'll put the forest that's live it's not a still photo so it's got like birds and butterflies flying around in it and i'll usually put another one on with a crackling fire but it's in my bag i've just come back from the starbucks and then i've got a kind of bathroom in here well i think you've seen that the bath usually just have a hot shower and then i'm trying all sorts of different ways to think about uh soundproofing these windows um these are blocks. Uh, it's a bit expensive way to do like that. And then anyway, this door is pretty heavy. But yeah, this is kind of it really. So I have a bathroom in here, which will, yeah, that would be pretty soundproofing. Cause we get, there's a, a basketball court down there and that's gonna get pretty noisy when we're going back to face-to-face -to -face lessons. This is much, so this is really where it all happens. This is where I do most of my work, sitting uh, here and just spending kind of as much as I can, like half the day out in amongst these very human-y environments. And um, but it's nice. I mean, the lighting does wonders. Um, normally it's sort of more like that. <laughs> So it hides a multitude of sins, and I've got the aircon up there. And, uh, <coughs> excuse me. So that is usually how it is. It's nice and tranquil, and with these fans blowing the air through. And I've got it, like, so I've got an uh, AC up there. And then alternating between going and meditating in there, and then working with my students online here. And then having this nice sort of tweeting, uh, usually a crackling log fire here. It's kind of like being in the forest. So that's it. So I'll upload this to YouTube and waz it off to you. I don't think there's anything else about here really that's particularly interesting. Here's my schedule for working through the therapy book. <laughs> Blue tack everywhere, as you might have anticipated from the old days yeah this one um basically i did that this morning you can't really see it but uh no just working around them anger communication skills negative thinking depression anxiety perfectionism confidence and low self-esteem so yeah that's it um all you need for a really peaceful lifestyle so as i can tell it's on the money. I don't pay any rent. I get those meals made by Annalyn downstairs and uh, Bob's your uncle. Okay, Mel China, I'll waz that on to YouTube and send you it off. I doubt this will go via Gmail. I suppose you could try. All right, my love, take it easy. Country walk time.